Hello and welcome to the wellness series from Relatives for Justice. My name is Roisin Kearns. This short video today I am introducing you to a technique called mental rehearsal. It is um, one of the first techniques that I um, was taught on my life coaching journey and, um, and I still use it very regularly. Um, and I think it's so beneficial to everybody, but it is a proven technique. I'm not going to get into the whole ins and outs of the theory, but just just know it is a proven technique. So if you use it, it will work for you. Um, but the key is to to use it, to take action and do it every day. So what you're actually doing. So imagine, think about it now for a moment. When you wake up in the morning, what are the first thoughts that come into your head? Quite often we wake up and we think, oh no, oh, I didn't sleep good, I feel so sore. And oh no, I have to see such and such today, I have so much to do. Quite often they're dread, thoughts of dread, you know, or, um, you know, quite negative. And that can influence how we show up in the rest of our day. You know, so what I'm going to invite you to do is when you wake up in the morning, when the negative thoughts come in, make a choice to yourself. Say, I'm not going to think about that right now, but instead spend a few moments visualising how you want to be in your day. For example, you might see yourself as being more lighthearted and more present for maybe your loved ones. And um, perhaps you might um, visualise yourself more energised maybe doing the things that you plan to do or you keep putting off, like going for that walk, spending a bit of time in nature. So I'm just going to re reiterate. So when you wake up in the morning, quite often the negative thoughts are coming in. Or like, think, oh, I'm so tired. I've so much to do today. I have to see such and such. And they, you know, they really annoy me. You know, those kind of things. So you're going to park that, make a decision, make a choice. I'm not going to think about that right now. Instead, I'm going to take a few minutes to visualise how I want to be in my day. Okay, so you would close your eyes and I'll do that with you now. Just close your eyes. Picture yourself and see yourself in the way that you want to be. For example, you might see yourself as more lighthearted, noticing and seeing the humour in things. Perhaps you'll see yourself more energised, going for that walk that you wanted to do. Perhaps you see yourself as calmer, more grounded, less anxious, you know. So just visualise just for a few moments how you want to be in your day. And the key to this, folks, is doing it every single day, okay? So maybe... A good idea is to say, give yourself a goal to do it for one week. So for the next seven days, visualise how you want to be in your day. So, and then I'd love you to let us know how you get on. Um, so leave your comments below this video. Um, so what have you to lose? I mean, if it's always, if you've always done the same thing, you've always had the same thought pattern, why not try, try something new? Just give it a go. You've nothing to lose, you know. If you were to do it for the next seven days, how might you feel by the end of it? And if you don't do it for the next seven days, how might you feel by the end of it? You know, so you've really nothing to lose. So try it for seven days and then after that, it is a tool for life. You can use this every single day. And I guarantee if you use it, it will help you to feel better. Thank you for watching and I'll see you again soon. Goodbye. I dropped my little thing.